Does everything seem plain and boring to you? We know a few easy ways of how to change it. Do you attend extra classes and mix up your schedule? Make a DIY calendar. Draw eight columns on an A4 paper sheet. Make sure the first one is wider than the others. Make as many lines as how many classes you attend. Write down weekdays in the top line. Put your classes into the first column. Attach bright stickers to the intersections of the days and classes and forget about mixing up the stuff. Are you often caught cheating in class? Use these school hacks to make your cheat sheets unnoticeable. Eraser cheat sheet? It's an awesome trick. Cut out a part of your eraser. Cut out a smaller square. Attach your cheat sheet using double-sided tape. Stick the other end to the eraser and fold it accordion style. Put it in the cutout. Can you see your cheat sheet? Transform your eraser into a cheat sheet holder in one move. You can easily take it out and quickly put it in. It'll help if you write it in hand rather than print it out. The written information can be remembered better. A ruler is a useful supply, especially if it's used for cheating. Write necessary formulas on a clear ruler. Attach clear tape to keep the writing in place. It works perfectly well for the short formulas that you mix up all the time. Are your covers too big? Trim them to fit your notebooks. Mark the appropriate size. Heat a craft knife. Cut off the cover using a ruler. The knife seals the cover where necessary. No more unfitting covers. Make your notebooks neat and tidy. Do you have empty glue bottles left? Fill them with paint and prank your friend. Remove the dispenser from an empty liquid gel pen. Fill it with acrylic paint you use frequently. Put on the dispenser. It'll spread an even amount of paint over the paper. Squeeze the paint into an empty glue bottle with a brush. Does your friend need glue? Give her your glue pen. Oops, it's paint. Try it again. This time, give her your glue bottle. It's paint inside. On the other hand, it's beautiful. Besides, you can paint without using additional brushes. Where to put a brush for keeping your desk clean? Use a clothespin as a brush holder. Fasten a brush with a clothespin and put it on the desk. Use this life hack and you won't have to rinse your brush each time you are distracted from your painting. Do you always keep two things on hand? A lipstick and a flash drive? We'll show you a way to join them. Remove the printed circuit board from the plastic casing. Take an empty lipstick container. Join your flash drive with the tube. At last they've met. I think it's love. The flash drive perfectly fits the lipstick tube. My friend can't get why the heck I took my lipstick while working on the laptop. It's okay. I'm not going to put on lipstick right now. There's a memory stick inside. I've got an amazing lipstick idea as well. Cut off the excess from a refill. Take an empty lipstick tube and attach the shortened pen into it. Apply hot glue onto the nib and sprinkle with glitter. What a lovely little pen! Your friend doesn't expect to see a pen instead of a lipstick. But she quickly gets used to writing with this convenient pen. Put your modeling clay into a makeup jar to prevent it sticking to everything in your backpack. Cut the clay sticks to fit the jar. Put them in. Embellish the top. Cut out a circle of the appropriate size from self-adhesive paper and stick it onto the top. Is it your new cream? No, it's not. It's my modeling clay. Let's create 3D beauty. Do you need a note holder? 
No problem. It'll take a couple of minutes to make it. We've got a number of clothespin springs left. We'll use them in this life hack. Put the springs together. We'll need three pieces to form a triangle. Make another of the same detail. Join two wooden parts by the flat sides. Make sure the clothespin tips are opposite to each other. Put the spring triangles onto the sides. Take two short wooden skewers and a couple of mini clothespins. Hot glue the skewers and pins. Put them in the pin notches. Attach the note tags. The light and suitable note holder will help organize your schedule. My friend's finished drawing. Now she's trying to put her felt tip pens into a case. I think it's impractical. I show her my smart DIY case. Take a piece of felt and a pack of pens. Mark off the pack outline with an allowance. Cut out a felt strip. Fold it to make a pocket for the pens. Hot glue. Take a thin rubber band. Snip off the excess. Attach it in the middle. Hot glue the end of the rubber band. Press a small felt piece on top. Trim the flap lid on both sides to let it close easily. Put in the felt tip pens. Tuck the flap lid under the rubber band and inside the felt pocket. Embellish the case with soft and pearl beads. Hot glue randomly on the front part. Keep your felt tip pens in a cute practical case. When my friend and I start picking up our school supplies, we mix them up each time. Use this life hack to learn which is what from the first glance. Attach decorative tape to your pens, pencils, markers, and a glue stick. Now you can easily recognize your school supplies in a heap of stuff. There will be no confusion anymore. My friend is a real master of planning. I like her sticker schedule hack. Attach stickers of different colors to your schedule. Define your daily routine. Think out what you should do in the morning, in the afternoon, and in the evening. Not bad. I think I should do the same for myself. We can share another tip on how to make convenient ice cream bookmarks. Attach the dessert images to the paper strips folded in half. Attach two squares of a magnet sheet to the strip ends. Perfect! The magnets will hold the page tight and the bookmarks will cheer you up. Besides, these desserts are absolutely calorie free. Wow! How cute! A lollipop paper clip and full red lips. We'll need two colors of the polymer clay green and red. Start with red. Take a small piece, knead it, and roll a ball. Now make a thin roll. Tear off the excess. Repeat for the green clay. Twist the rolls to form a rope. Coil it to shape a snail. It fits well. Now we'll need only red clay. Mold the lips, roll it up and curve to make the upper lip. Roll out the ball with the rolling pin to make the lower lip. Place the upper lip on top to see if they are of the same size. Correct the shape. Attach the upper lip. Add the details. Try it on the clip. Bake the crafts. Follow the instructions on your polymer clay package as for the baking time and temperature. Hot glue the cool embellishments to the clips.
The decorated clips will personalize your school supplies and add bright colors to the boring stationery. Join us and subscribe to the Trim Trim channel. You'll find plenty of awesome school supply ideas to meet any taste. Click the bell to be the first to watch a new video.